folks, I'm going to show you guys how to remove the tail lights on a 2005 Jeep Grand Cherokee Limited. They seem to be different between different models. So this one, uh, unfortunately, has the Torx, not the Phillips. So the Torx is a T25. You want to make sure that you uh, use the proper Torx so you don't strip them out. Uh, and once you do this, I already took the top one out. Hand. Sorry about that. Now, you might think you're going to break these things. You don't pull them out to the side. All you do is you just pull on the edge here, put your fingers in here, and pull it straight back. And give it a couple tugs, and she should pop right off. And the reason is because they got these little uh, knobby boots here that fit in these rubber grommets, and they help lock this tail light in, uh, it locks the tail light into place on the back side. So uh, once you do that, um, as you can tell, I have three light bulbs on mine. Uh, some only have two. Uh, this one, uh, unfortunately, has three. So if you want to know which one your brake bulb is, it's this top one. So this way you don't have to go and jam something on the brake pedal to see which one it is. Uh, so it's the top bulb. So all you do to take these off, um, you can squeeze them, but my fingers suck for that. So I'm just going to get a screwdriver. I'm going to stick it in here. I'm going to press that tab till it clicks. All right, that clicked. Press this till it clicks, and it lifts right up. It's supposed to. This side's on still. There it goes. You hear the click. There's your ball. Comes off in one complete unit. Now I'm going to let this dangle here, because it ain't going to hurt. And then uh, I'm going to replace the bulb here with a uh, LED bulb. This one's not burnt out, but the other side did burn out, so I'm going to replace them with the LED bulbs. And if you guys want to know exactly what the number is for your LED bulb, it is a 3157 on the top, but a 3057, 3047. They're all compatible with this bulb, so uh, that just goes to show you, and I'll show you in a second here. Uh, hold on one sec. All right, so I'm going to pull this bulb out install the new bulb this funny part is your bulb actually it comes out of the sides here if you can see back here there's your led lights so you got to grab this just like you did the original and press it right in you hear a click you're good to go then you just simply put this back on there's no wires to plug in all the contacts for the electronics are actually inside the tail light which uh hit those contacts right there so we're going to put those and you should hear it click and there's that click there's that click you are now officially good to go and put this back on don't know what this goes to spare parts have no clue anyway looks like some kind of a lock for the uh the thing uh, but here, let's go and uh put this bad boy back together here so all we're going to do is just repeat the process by simply and I'm doing this one-handed, so this ain't exactly as easy as it may look. But once you line those little holes up, you just give it a push. And it should pop itself right back into the holes. There's that. You just hear it and feel it. And then you're ready to put your tail light right back on again. It is that easy, folks. Anyway, this is Red Hat Reviews. Hope uh, my camera was at least in the ability to record what I was doing. Anyway, peace out. It's that easy.